Hi YouTube, Zippy Zappy Z here, and uh, I meant to make this video a few days ago, but I don't know what happened. I just kind of forgot about it, and when I did make the video, uh, it ra I ran out of battery in the middle of it, so I decided to wait, and I think this is the perfect time to tell you guys I got a Traxxas Revo. Uh, it's the older version, so 2.5R. But this is a little custom. It has a custom head on it. And because that engine only has less than a gallon of gas through it, as I was told from the seller I bought it from, let's see if I can find it. Is it around here? Oh, right here. I decided this was that head I thought never fit. Turns out I was just putting it in wrong the whole time. It does fit. And when that engine dies or whatever, doesn't work anymore, got to put this one in. Now, I probably could have put it in here, but for this one, I, instead of buying a 3.3 again, I got a, what is it, a Dynamite .19 Mach 2 engine. And this truck will be running next week. And, uh, yeah. I'll have three trucks running, and actually my Exceed is not is running, but not fully. I was looking at the engine the other day, and I realized something was missing. There is one of the screws that hold down the engine head were missing. So I bought those uh, today, and they should be coming in the mail. My custom truck, same as last time, nothing different. Uh, everything else, same same as last time. Uh, my dirt tracks is coming along. Let's see if I can get this out. Yeah, wait. Okay. Right here. This is how my dirt tracks is looking. Got the everything a little set up, you know. This is gonna end up coming around like this, as I saw. And it's going to connect to the battery piece that's in the back. And I'll probably, for this one, just put this pack in it. Once I get the new box for the back. And actually, that would fit. That would reach. Be perfect. But yeah, you know, a little update here and there. And the only reason why I bought this Revo was because I always wanted a Revo. And it's it's great condition. A little dirty. Nothing a little cleaning up can't do, you know. And I took out the wire harness before I was seeing how good it revved and it revs very nicely. And uh yeah, when that engine starts to go, I'll probably put this 2.5 in for a little while. And I'm not going to let this one die, though. I want this to be, uh, like, shown as my first engine, because it is, like, my first engine I've ever used before. And, uh, I was going to put in my Megatech little car. Uh, who knows, maybe I will. It'll be one less engine I have to buy. <laughs> Yeah, but this 3.3 already had a few gallons through it, so uh, I wasn't surprised. And uh, that 3.3 only had about a quart or two through it, so I'm pretty mad with Traxxas. And uh, they said that it voids the warranty because I got it through eBay. But I know the engine was brand new because it looked brand new, and I had to do the whole break-in process and all that. Whatever, you know. Sometimes... Life isn't always fair. Uh, my Himoto, I was looking at it the other day, and I realized that this piece over here is broken. Let me get a light. Let's see. This piece right here is broken. So I'm going to buy that piece for both sides, because, uh... Wait, is this one broken? Yeah, this one, I believe, is broken somewhere.
I don't remember where though. But yeah. Yeah, that's really it, YouTube, you know. Uh, not much more. Here's a look at my custom truck. My Megatech, I haven't even looked at it in a while. Oh. I want now I know why. And I will be buying uh I believe if I do keep all of them, 2.4 gigahertz transmitter and receivers for all of them. This one came with a 27 megahertz receiver and uh, transmitter and all that. But I, uh, I'm looking right now on eBay on uh, buying a 2.4. And I think that's it. I don't even feel like taking my Exceed out. Too lazy. Otherwise, you know, everything else is coming along. 3.3s is over here. Screws. Yeah. Oh. That's it, YouTube. Zippy Zappy Z. Signing out.